Which of the following relations could be produced by y equals 2 fifths x minus 6? We have choices 1, 2, and 3. Let's rewrite choice number 1 here. We have the equal sign here. I'm going to move the 5 over, the 5y over to the right, adding 5y's to both sides. So we have 5y is equals to 2x, and then minus 30 stays on this side here. I'm going to divide each part by 5. So we have y is equals to 2 divided by 5, x, and minus 30 divided by 5 is the same thing as minus 6. So we have y equals 2 fifths x minus 6. And we can see here that this indeed is the same as this line equation here, so choice number one is correct. Now, what we have here in choice number two is a bunch of different points. And if all these points actually fit on to this line, we can say that this line actually produces these points. So we just have to test out each of these points. So I'm gonna test out the first point where x is 15 and y is zero. So we're gonna verify the zero equal 2 fifth x, which is 15, minus 6. And what we have here is 15 divided by 5 is 3. 3 times 2 is 6. 6 minus 6 is 0. So this point is correct. Let's try another one. Does y, which is negative 2, does this equal 2 fifth x, which is 10, minus 6? 10 divided by 5 is 2, 2 times 2 is 4. 4 minus 6 is negative 2, so indeed, this point works. Let's test the third point. So this y, which is negative 8, does it equal 2 fifth x, which is negative 5, minus 6? Negative 5 divided by 5 is negative 1, so we have negative 2 here. Negative 2 minus 6 is negative 8. This point works out as well. Let's try y, which is negative 10. Does it equal 2 fifth x, which is negative 10, minus 6? We have negative 10 divided by 5, which is negative 2. Negative 2 times 2 is negative 4. Negative 4 minus 6 is negative 10, so this point also works. So we say that this line here produces all these points. Check. So finally, let's take a look at this graph here. So we have this line equation y equals 2 fifth x. We know that 2 fifth is a positive slope, slightly uphill like this. And this here is a negative slope. So this is definitely not the same line we're talking about. So choices one and two are correct, which means that choice C is our candidate.